the Independent Investor Channel. My name is Ryan. I'm compelled to offer uh, one last uh, update on the Aduro Clean Technology story. Uh, as we sit now, uh, I am purposely uh, staying off the airwaves um, for uh, respect of the current process and uh, uplisting uh, and the uh, pending application that they have with the SEC. Um, I also have felt compelled over this time period to take a breather, um, reassess, and engage in uh, another form of due diligence. If you haven't reviewed the F-1 filing with the SEC, you, you can do that. I can provide you a link in the description below that will give you the uh, latest color surrounding uh, the base date of application, which is available to you. Um, the detailed, and I do mean detailed in all 76 pages, I read every one of them. Um, some of them are worth skimming through because you can get the idea of, you know, um, shares and units offered over the history, very, very detailed of the goings on with Aduro. Um, but uh, in your best interest to do so, a re-review of the forward-facing information on adurocleantech.com, that of which I have been very open over the last um, going on two and a half years of covering the company. Uh, covering the company uh, at its inception at 52 cents. We currently sit at $1.44. That's pre split um, basis, uh, which equates to about $4.69 US, um, which represents uh, an overall profit since we started covering the company of 176% of an increase. My friends, legends are made by those numbers. Uh, uh, let me repeat legends are made by those numbers. Um, I am up significantly in the company. Uh, if you uh, chose uh, to take this ride with us and determined that uh, Adura was a place that uh, fit into your portfolio, um, you have uh, benefited from the appreciating stock price uh, since we've started covering the company. And congratulations. There will be three schools of thought on this application. There will be those that agree with me and have uh, probably validated in the size of their portfolio how incredibly huge and the magnitude of this um, opportunity is with the Duro. There will be detractors which would suggest that some of the highlights that I'm going to convey with you in this update um, are not true, uh, are too good to be true, uh, are absolutely far-fetched, and will never come to fruition. There is a third camp of folks out there that will be introduced to the Aduro Clean Technology story for the first time. I do contend that the very best is in front of us. Uh, I leave uh, a disclaimer in the bottom to explain my uh, affiliation with Aduro Clean Technologies and the circumstances surrounding my involvement with Aduro and my continued coverage of the company. Uh, I also convey down to the share amount my exact cost basis and number of shares held as a long share owner in the company. I have share owned shares for the last two and a half straight. Um, I have shared one liquidation that I've made through the uh, evolution of covering this project. Uh, and I do intend on owning shares long based on the due diligence that I have just completed some of the attributes of a DuroClean technology have absolutely uh, stood the test of time and have been further defined uh, over that same time period of me covering the company, uh, specifically the uh, efficiency rate, the superior yield over other solutions out there at over 90%. Okay. Um, the minimal post-processing, all of this information is available on Aduro Clean Technologies. And again, um, whether you feel in the agreement or the disagreement bucket or you're just being introduced, I, I would encourage all uh, would-be patrons to the message or those that are consuming this content to use this as a critical referral to a company that with their seven current patents over this novel technology, which is a precursor of being awarded those seven patents and one pending. It is incumbent upon all of those folks out there for a couple of minutes to take note on a very, very quick 
um, delivery on for those folks that are just now being introduced to Aduro Clean Technologies for the first time? Because you might say, Ryan, the money's made. I beg to differ. We are just getting started. Um, as reporting out in this video, in this interim process, we currently have zero, I do repeat zero, partnerships in the customer engagement program, okay? Um, there are current dealings right now with seven, seven multi-billion dollar companies that are either in the research and development phase or in the collaborative phase of their customer engagement process. What does that mean? It means that Aduro's getting the attention of some of the largest companies in the world, number one. Um, number two, they have grown that customer portfolio significantly since we have started um, providing some color and an approach to how they are going to engage with customers. I'll talk about how that's super important in their uh, versatility plan and path toward uh, 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 profitability and revenues uh, that will be generated quicker than taking more of a one-stop approach. Okay, I look at a company like Pure Cycle that's putting multi millions of dollars into an iron ton facility, and, and it's kind of an all eggs in one basket. Aduro's taking a completely different approach with their technology, rolling it out smartly, rolling it out with some fiscal acknowledgments in that they've got to get this thing right to share in the risk with their would-be customers, build those engagements uh, together and identify those uh, gaps at where Aduro can actually fit the technology into these existing businesses. We'll talk about that in just a second. Um, but Aduro's hydrochemolytic technology and its tolerance for contaminants cannot be overstated. These are real claims. This isn't just me. I'm communicating what comes off of the website. And I highly encourage you guys to double down on all of this stuff and make sure that you're reaffirming for yourself where the bullish confidence from me that I convey over the channel comes from, okay? This is not my opinion. I, I'm, I'm merely reading over the facts that Aduro shares in the public face, okay? Extrapolating that and identifying where the value could be, i.e., they have not signed any partnerships just yet, but I want to talk about the summary on where the future is going to go and, and what the future could hold for Aduro Clean Technologies as we look to put some of these attributes to work and are being verified and run through the paces right now under R&D and under collaborative phases currently as we speak, okay? We have a looming uplisting that is on the horizon at some point in our future, okay? When that will be, I, I will not speculate, usually four to six weeks to give you some level of, of insight, uplisting to the NASDAQ, which is a more appropriate um, market for, or more ap appropriate uh, um, uh, uh, market for a Duro uh, to uplist to. But, lower emissions in their process, energy efficient, okay, lower um, uh, temperature inputs, therefore lower cost to run the technology, uh, and then support circularity, right, by e being able to produce a product that can be reintroduced back into the circular economy to make new products. That really in, is, in a nutshell, what we've known and what has kind of evolved to those talking points over the last couple of years of studying the company. I want to mention a couple of things here that once we get this uplisting done, I expect to see some real churn and some real momentum pick up in the company goings on. I'm not going to forecast for you guys what I think is going to happen with the stock because I don't know. Nobody does, okay? And where this company is right now in the beginning stages of just starting to fine-tune what their commercial processes could look like, it is incumbent upon us to stay hungry on the landscape and report out on any of the uh, updates that Aduro has on this front. But what sets Aduro apart for the, the future? What do we know about the company now and what to expect here in 2024? 
Um, we can expect by nature of their declaration to share owners an active scale up to commercial operations. This is their next generation um, a reactor that if accepted, the proceeds of the uplisting and IPO um, will fully fund that next generation process. This is going to be a breakthrough in the evolution of the company and one major step toward commercial operations. Very, very excited. It hasn't happened yet. That's why this video is so important for the three uh, uh, different viewers of the channel to uh, uh, agree with me, disagree that that will ever happen. I've seen some detractors to suggest that the uplisting will never happen and that this company is is working on pure speculation at this point. The attributes that I've laid out are what has evolved and been fine-tuned over the last two and a half years. They are, as I report, and they are uh, conveyed on AduroClean Tech dot com for your review um, and and extrapolation as to what they could potentially mean for you. All right. The accelerated path to revenue through versatility. This basically means an ability to take their technology and deploy it either on a large scale, a medium scale, or a small scale. This gives Aduro an upper hand in maybe moving some of the smaller projects along quicker to boost the bottom line or the top line, uh, for that matter, to start to generate some, some churn on the revenue side and help insulate the company from high capital expenditures in in standing up a lot of these facilities and the high cost that comes with the infrastructure necessary to deploy a final commercial product at at these entities okay it's going to help in a, a cost sharing initiative and that versatility really speaks to a very interesting approach that aduro is taking as opposed to putting hundreds of millions of capital at risk and and you know risking everything on a on a one stop shop in a, in a one facility where everything has to be trucked in to that one location, Aduro takes their technology to the customer and engages with the customer until they are ready to understand each other's strengths and weaknesses and how those can augment each other and 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 create a partnership that's long standing and worthwhile and the way that aduro says is extremely efficient okay they're not going to know right away if a business is going to need a lot of what aduro has or maybe just a little or start with a future expectation to build upon. This versatility is key in understanding how incredible this opportunity is, okay? Uh, the commercial unit and the continuous flow is going right now. That is on Adura's website. You can read that. Um, they have fact sheets on there, that of which I will show and provide you the links to in the description below. I encourage you to look at that, those facts are identified there and they are on the public face. Knowledge is key here, my friends, okay? Knowledge is key. And I will close with this. There is something that is brewing on the surface here or below the surface, all right? Things are quiet. Every single day of this week in the stock market, a Duro Clean Technologies that has reverted back to the old ticker symbol, ACTHF, have climbed slowly higher every single day has seen the stock appreciate in value again i don't want to speculate on the future of where the stock price has gone what we can do is look at a stock price that at the time of covering this on the independent investor channel we were trading at a mere 52 cents we are trading right now on a pre-split basis of a dollar 44 which represents 176 0.92% of increased value for the would-be share owners of this company from the onset until the day we speak now. It closed Friday at $4.69 US. My friends, it is just getting started. I congratulate you on the earnings. Again, legends are made by proclaiming your ability to turn people on to stock and make over and above returns on stock price.
Congratulations to those who have taken the ride and understand the baseline fundamentals that I covered in this video really do speak to the below surface value here that they will put to rigor into the end of 2024 and into 2025 to eventually step this technology into a commercial state. My friends, buckle your safety belts because this is going to be a ride of incredible proportions. It's going to be fun to sit back and understand that no matter how slow, no matter how fast, a Duro is moving in the right direction. And that is indicative indicative of the stock price that has done nothing but share uh, uh, reward share owners over the last couple of years. And I believe that the best is yet to come. Guys, thank you so much for tuning in to this update on Aduro Clean Technologies. We eagerly await the uplist. I would ask for your continued patience in understanding what they are trying to do here. It is a big big deal and i am trying to respect the sensitivity around the application read the application for yourself revisit the website call it due diligence number two you need to be up to speed on and know what you own and why you own it when this thing starts to accelerate my friends because i don't think it's a question of if rather a question of when this is going to happen and aduro gives you some clues on when we could expect a potential massive re-rate in this company based on the attributes that surrounding the technology and the moat that they have with this technology and the value that is ready to be unlocked. Guys, thank you so much for tuning in. Subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, leave your comments at the bottom of the video, guys. And thank you so much for uh, sticking with me for the entirety of the video. And good luck in your investment future. <music>